Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Well, Miss uh, Jill Biden, or my bad, uh, Dr. Jill Biden, the First Lady of the United States of America, she unfortunately uh, contracted um, COVID again. So she tested positive for COVID. Uh, what can I say? I feel sorry for her. But the problem is, she is, uh, according to uh, many, double vaccinated and uh, some got some booster shots. Uh, obviously, some people were quick to uh, point the finger at that. And then people said, no, that's a lie. This is this is that. I do not like fact checkers. Not because I don't like to be fact checked. I don't like people who tell me, for instance, based on my conclusion, I mean, tell me, tell me or tell you that my conclusion is wrong based on some evidence and information knowledge that I present. So let's say I, I give a lecture, I use, I know, 50 books that I read uh, on that issue, direct experience, studies and so on. And at the end, I make my point. And I say, this is my conclusion on this one. And then the fact checkers will say, your conclusion is wrong. You're lying. How can you, how, how can you figure that out? Now, I don't need uh, get gatekeepers of truth, okay? I don't need them. Well, they can be there, but I will not use them as being reliable. Why? Because when uh, there's always an interest, then you have uh, you know, bad consequences. So what happened here? I'm going to use a fact checker to fact check if uh, Jill Biden caught COVID after double vaccination and booster shots. And guess what? That's accurate. But put it in the context and so on. Now, let me show you this article coming from, I don't know who these are, Snopes. And um, it says here, fact check, Jill Biden caught COVID after double vaccination and booster shots. This is a question. And it says that she purportedly caught the virus for a second time. It's right here for a second time in September 2023, after multiple rounds of shots. Now, I don't know, I don't really care, you know, you can uh, booster your ass as much as you want, okay? You can do whatever you want with your body if you want to do this, or I don't want you to try to alter my reality or force me to alter my reality according to your, okay? Or make me be like you, I don't want that. And I don't want you to be like me. You'll be like you. So let's go and see what's going on here. We have claim after receiving a two dose initial vaccination series and two additional booster shots, US First Lady Jill Biden tested positive for COVID-19 in September 23, 2023. This is a claim and a rating true. They say the fact checkers. Okay. Now I guess they don't like the fact checkers, but they give us the context, all right? When it comes to preventing new infections, infections, COVID-19 vaccines have waned in effectiveness since the early months of the pandemic. That said, they remain effective at reducing serious illness and death. Public health agencies such as Centers of Disease Control and Prevention, CDC, and the World Health Organization still recommend them, recommend them for those reasons. Well, good for you. Take him. Now, on September 4th, 2023, Fox News and other media outlets reported the First Lady Jill Biden not only tested positive for COVID-19 a second time since the pandemic started in 2020, but also she was double vaccinated and boosted twice. Positive again, Fox News. The First Lady is double vaccinated and boosted twice, read uh, her office's statement. The problem is, yeah, keep, keep that, all right? All right, no problem. Do whatever you want, my man. Each of these assertions is true. A September 4, 2023 statement attributed to the First Lady's office read, This evening, the First Lady tested positive for COVID-19. She is currently experiencing only mild symptoms. She will remain at their home in Bababap, Delaware. Okay, good. That was indeed Biden's second time catching COVID in August 2022. August, that's a year. A year. Caught two times. She also contracted the disease. At that time, Biden's communication director, blah, 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 confirmed a statement that she was double vaccinated and twice boosted then, which meant 
that she has received a two-dose initial vaccine vaccination series as well as two additional booster doses that aim to fight the virus. When it comes to preventing new infections, COVID-19 vaccines, vaccines have waned in effectiveness since the early months, bah, bah, bah. but they say they remain effective as reducing serious bah, 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 and public to do, do. Okay, good. Now, the problem, you know, the problem, I won't say there's not a problem, but, you know, but um, uh, Mr. Biden, the president, he didn't test positive for anything. That tells you how much time they spend together. <laughs> Zero. Uh, because if she got COVID at that little house in of Bethlehem or wherever they are, that means they are not really intersecting uh, their lives. I know he's very busy, okay, in the basement uh, where he's uh, maintained at, uh, I'm just kidding, okay, YouTube, at the proper temperature, you know, it is like freezing almost to keep him, keep his cells like uh, frozen so they don't go dead. They don't leave Biden. Biden is already, what, 95% dead. His cells, his, <laughs> and uh, before they, they, they dress him up and get him ready for the show, they stick things in his ass, in his nostrils, and then they put him in front of us and say, go, you got 15 minutes, buddy, 15 minutes, everything goes down. And I think all these things wane after about what? They're not effective, all this. And after a while, you're gonna be from 15 minutes, the show is gonna be, I know, 12 minutes, then six minutes, three minutes, and it's gonna be like, um, you know, uh, sometimes when you try to start your, I don't know, lawnmower or boom, it takes a while. So they, it takes a little while. And then he's just losing it. Those from 15 minutes he made, let's say, used to make three mistakes. Now in seven minutes he makes 20 mistakes. In three minutes in the future he's gonna make all mistakes. He's gonna now, he's been diving almost every other week. And then he's gonna jump to diving, I don't know, every week. And then it's gonna be every other day. And then it's gonna be every day. And it's gonna be no more because they can't make him up. <laughs> Not, not responsive, my man. What are we gonna do? Cheat? Bring the double again. <laughs> anyway, man, take your vaccines if you want. If you don't, I don't want to be, uh, you know, pushed into doing anything. And I'm still alive. And I knew. And I know. And uh, masks. Well, yeah, they're gonna. The next one's gonna be masks and mandates. They already started with that. Okay. So the empathetic tyrants. Uh, will go into that because that's the way it is right now. Based on empathy, they will uh, be tyrants. You know, in the name of this, you, why you don't you care? In, uh, because I care, I'm going to infringe and uh, limit your freedoms and liberties. That's what's going on right now. Thank you very much. It's going to go even more. This time, I think they're going to try more than last time. That's what my my I said it before many times, and I say it again during the pandemic and now. Why? It's like a bully. First time I get your, uh, I mean, I just scare you. Sec second time I get your lunch. The third time I get your girlfriend. Fourth time I beat you up, you and your girlfriend. The fifth time I come and get your car and get them. Uh, so you know, that's the way it goes. So it, it usually doesn't go down unless you oppose it. And I don't see these guys opposing it. Look what happened the first time. Pfft, that was the land of the brave. Give me a break. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong. Man up, man. Man up. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth and be just.